Let's talk today a little bit about modern swings versus more traditional swings. You know, here's what I see happening on the PJ Tour, and I think it's because we're understanding how to teach people to use their body much more efficiently during the golf swing to create more speed. You know, you really have three power sources in the golf swing. I like to call it the ABCs of power. A is arm swing, B is body rotation, and C is club lever, right? So those are your three sources of power. Now, in kind of the traditional swing, you would see a lot of body rotation, a lot of arm swing, and a lot of leverage, a longer golf swing. And that's fine, but keep this in mind, it is harder to time. It takes more practice, and the reason why is because it impact, every great player at impact, no matter whether it's modern or traditional, you would see the player at impact where everything matches up. The club head, the hands, the body center all match up. The club face is square. The longer your swing and the more travel of your arms and the more use of your wrists, the harder it is to time. Now what you're seeing with some of these younger players in the tour is they're learning to maximize their body, right? The power of their body so they don't have to overuse their arms. Now here's what I mean by that. If you look at modern players, when they go back, they're really loading into that right quad, right glute, and they got a lot of power from their body, so they're storing a bunch of energy. Now, what's happening when they do that is they don't have to overuse their arms. Now, why is that easier? And they have just as much power as the long arm swing player. So if I load my body properly, I can really have a shorter, more effective arm swing, which makes it a lot easier to time to get my arms to come back the same time to the ball as my body does. So it matches up better. So that's what you're seeing. So if you really work on how you load your body, you can in effect shorten your arm swing and get your club head to match up with your body. So something to work on, maybe to think about, load up a little bit better, shorten your arm swing, and you'll find you can match up better and have more consistency and certainly better bad shots. And then you'll find that ball closer to the hole more often, you'll score lower.